so anyway, biology update. Ba -da -ba -da -bang. Okay, so I got an email from my biology professor. Oh, okay. oh and by the way, uh, for those of you who don't know, we talked about this in the very first Let's Play we came back with, episode one of Fall Guys. Mm -hmm. So if you guys want to check that out just to see where it was before, but there's an update. So, got an email from my biology professor, and he said, uh, okay class, um, after seeing like what's been going on with everybody, I feel like we have to make this class a little bit easier, because so, so as I said it in initially, yeah. I suck at biology, and I was, wasn't doing good on the quizzes at all. Yeah. So, come to find out, I'm not doing well. Okay. Other people have been suffering. So, what it is now is like, there's no longer a webcam for the quizzes, mm -hmm. so we can't watch us or anything, and we have multiple attempts on the quizzes now. Uh -huh. So originally it was just, you know, one, one attempt, attempt and done, done, but now there's three attempts. Okay. And of course the best score is the grade you're going to be scored with. And, oh, that's not the right one. Okay, and, um, and um, there are four exams this semester. The lowest scored one is getting dropped, uh -huh. so it's not going to count. Okay. And yeah, so as you can see, this is uh, a good update. Yeah, it's good. Was like, really he, began, good. he began like a psychopath, and I was like, <laughs> as a tyrant, yeah. I should watch you all. Yeah, I need to watch you all. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, but yeah, it's made uh, me definitely like. Thank God. Yeah, yeah. I need a chance here, man. That's good, man. That's, that's awesome. Yeah. It's so interesting because, like, I honestly didn't know how the other classes are doing because obviously I haven't talked to any or who, yeah. who, who else. I don't even know. Exactly. You don't even know who's part of the class. Exactly. Like, it's virtual. Like, why would you do it, you know? So it's good to see that I'm not the only one, like, uh, sucking. Suffering. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what's the class you're actually taking that has to do with your career right now? Um, really none. Like, the most, the closest is, like, intro to theater. Oh. But I'm really just focusing on the gen eds this semester. Because oh, you're not doing intro to theater right now? Uh, except that one. That's the only one that's like uh, more of a focus what on. Do you, what do you guys do for that class? Like, online? How's that, how's that like? It's really just been like listening to his lectures and like taking the quizzes. But it's all the stuff I already really know because it's intro to theater and I took theater in high school for four years. So I know all, all about the different types of stages and like the different genres and like all that. So it's like you're, you're just learning stuff. It's just to get a credit. Yeah, it's pretty much. It's, it's very easy. What just happened? Okay, so the elder went on a 10 hour lecture, uh -huh. much like my biology professor, uh -huh. uh, to Puny about how you should have rescued the other ones and not her. So he just dipped? After the lecture she dipped, yeah. Okay. And Mario and Flurry fell asleep because of course like, they're not going to pay attention to that. <laughs> really? Yeah, look, oh, yeah, they're snoring. Look, look, he, they're leaving, he's <laughs> leaving them in the cage, dude. Okay, they're back. Okay, so now we got to find the blue key to let them out. Just came back to the guy's back, you know. Yeah, for sure. I would have been like, okay, bye. And then we locked it back up. Do you, excuse me. You respect your elders, you know. Now that he's going to lecture me like that, okay. <laughs> lock you back up and throw away the key this time and like, make sure he never finds it. it. Camilo, don't you know, as long as you live a long life, you can do whatever you want. I, I don't think you knew that, but like, come on, bro. <laughs> yeah, this is like, it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't care that you're not nice to people. It's just like, it doesn't matter. Yeah, so I, I hate that. Yo, um, I, I, remember, I remember watching Naruto. So they, what they do with the elders, they, 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 they feel like you become an like, you become an advisor if you're an elder kind of thing. Mm -hmm. So I remember there's like the two elders of like the, the advisors of like of the town. I hate them so much. Like they just think they're always right. Like, yeah. The elders, like ah. Oh. Very annoying. I really hope I'm not like that. One. Ah. How about how about? How about the elders that were happening on stage a couple days ago? Oh, no, I... I, <laughs> I don't want to talk about that. Who is the best? Yeah, for, both those, sides, who, both sides. for those who don't know, um, the week we're recording this, the uh, first presidential debate just happened. So, of course, that was a, just a fun ride to watch as that unfolded. The moderator, though. Yeah. I'm, 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 I'm actually thinking about making a sketch about it, like, I, in where I'm the moderator, so then I get to ask them, like, dumb questions and, like, and, like, talk over them. It's like, I'm pretty sure at one point I'll be like, ah, blah, 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 yeah, you don't like when I talk over you, do you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, Why has the world come to that? I don't know, dude. Can you help with this? 
And there's two more. Is there two more? Yeah, because there's three in total. And the thing about it is funny too because like the point of the debate is really to try to start convincing people who they should vote for, but it's like no, 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 I th- I feel like at this point you should know like which side you uh, lean on. These these this, these debates actually basically hate both sides. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh god. Yeah, I feel like it's having the opposite effect. Like you know maybe I should uh, even partake in selection. What happened to Bernie Yang to the Yang yo? Yeah, <laughs> where are my boys? Where's Yang Yang at? Yang Yang. There's the burns. I can want to do the burn. I can come to you. I discovered something that I didn't even know was a thing. You know. I was at a local pizza place called George's. You went to George's? Yes, I did to get some food. Um, and while I was there waiting for my food, I uh, went into the bathroom. And then coming back out, I noticed that there was a machine to my left, and it was a cigarette vending machine. So is it, is it cigarette like packs, or is it like a cigarette? <laughs> Not just one cigarette. No, it's their packs. Okay. They're like Marlboro and like well, what are other companies? I don't know. Newports, you know, whatever. Um. So it was funny. It was like, does this thing work? Like I don't know. And then I did see someone use it. Someone really? actually used it while I was waiting. Somebody went up to it. Yeah, I was kind of just watching him, right? but he probably felt uncomfortable. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't like that. No, I, pff, it's fucking stupid. Like, how, okay, like, let's say, okay, te- technically it's inside, right? Yeah. Te- technically the owner can see you use it. But, like, how are you going to verify an age? You know, I didn't even think. And, by the way, like, it, this vending machine is, like, around the corner, so it's not even, like, in the point of view of if you're working behind the counter. Really? Yeah, you wouldn't see it. Okay, so they it. can't even see you. No, y- you wouldn't, they wouldn't see it unless they're going to the bathroom. So any kid can just go in there, pretty much, go to the bathroom, huh. and just be like, I really didn't even think. Is this, is this like, is this like, is this an illegal, like, vending machine? I don't, well, I is assume like, that, is, is it, I assume that America was riddled with the um, cigarette vending machines back in the day, but they got rid of them, all of them, except this one. I wonder how big this is going to be. Are we going to I don't know. Yeah, we might be exposing a, a, a local pizza joint. <laughs> Imagine if we really are. Nah, it, it, not because you get inspected at all. Yeah, right, right. They have right. government inspections. Yeah, yeah. So they, they have to know. Bro, that's crazy. That's not how is this legal. Like, like, you can't verify the age at all. Like, okay, like, I wouldn't stand like, uh, it's like right in front of the counter. If somebody in the kind of company can see a kid walk up the machine, then when you do it, yeah. like, hey, you kid, you can't do that. You know, kind of thing. Right. Or you can, like, you like, 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 or, like, if they, if they put in money, grab it, like, and just, like, they found their money, like, take it back, whatever. I don't know. But, like, you just can't remember the age. It's like, that's so weird. And, they, and talking about vending machines, bro, like, yeah, like, I saw, I saw this, it was not a vending machine, but, like, it's similar. I saw an app today being advertised on Snapchat. Like, you know how things like that as ads you watch your story? Yeah, like, yeah. I was an ad about, like, liquor. Because, like, oh, get liquor delivered to you, to your front door. So this is some sort of, like, alcohol delivery app? Yeah, like, like, a, like a grub hub, like a like DoorDash. But for alcohol? For alcohol. I downloaded it, but it didn't even, it didn't even make me, like, it didn't even make me create a profile. Okay. So, like, I'm not even sure how they verify ID. And I haven't used it yet to purchase. Are you telling me you're gonna trust a random driver to verify age? Or like... Yeah. Like, like okay, yeah, you might have to turn around to work for the app, and like, do delivery, but like... How do you... I don't know. I don't know how it's used, man, but like... Like, how are you verifying these, these people? Like, how are you verifying... How, how, how are you gonna ver- verify... Like... Yeah, you know, you're not 21. I don't know. I gotta, I gotta use the app more, but like, how do you feel about like, this being so... Rightly accessible about it? I'm just order online. I don't know. Really man. Like, it's definitely very convenient for adults, but... I, I actually, I, not, it's not a bad idea, like... No, it's not. Because, like, it, it can cause, like... Let's say you're drunk. You mm-hmm. want more. But you ran out. Yeah. And then, some people some people just jump drive to the liquor store. Right? Yeah, so that would prevent it, that from happening. If they had that. Yeah. So that's that that um, that I agree with. Like, oh shit! Like that's that's all that case. Yeah. Theoretically. <laughs> yeah. 
But like, it's like, it's not a bad idea, but it's just like, I don't, I don't know how they're verifying the trip system yet. To verify that you're 21, like, how, like, exactly, how yeah. serious it is. I don't know, like, do they ask for, like... Even with, like, in a COVID world where, like, the option, they're giving people options, like, oh, uh, drop off at your front door. It's like, yeah. easily under anyone under 21 can be like, yeah, leave it there. I don't want to get sick, which is the, the reason why I'm doing this. You know, maybe, 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 or oh, maybe, oh, I don't know. Or let, let's just, let's just say, I haven't used the app, but it's all speculation. Like, let's just say they make you take a picture of your ID. Hmm. What, what, what makes not a kid takes your mom's ID and take a picture? I, it might be like an Uber thing where they like, um, from time to time, uh, ask you to verify your identity. So they like uh, ask you to take a picture of yourself to make sure that it's that's the one that's on file. Does Uber do that to customers, like normal riders, or is it just for drivers? Uh, drivers. I don't know. I gotta use the app. I, I don't know why would I? I don't even have to use it. I don't have a reason to use it. Like, I have a like, for, like if I want liquor, like, liquor store, like. They could start down the street quite quickly. Like, yeah. Maybe it's convenient for you. You live in the middle of nowhere. Like, and for me, yeah, if there are any liquor stores near. And they, they promise over the, on the on the 60 minutes you can have this. That's their that's their quote. Mm. Get liquor in the 60 minutes. <laughs> and this app is called Drizzly. What's it called? Drizzly. Drizzly. This is not an ad, by the way. No. Try to try to try to try to purchase it right now. I have the app right now. I mean, if you really want to give it a shot. Oh, unfortunately, it doesn't deliver to your address here. Mm. So you can't do this. But it does deliver to my address, because I tried it at home. Right, and I assume so, because you live in a city. Yeah. But it doesn't do your city, man. Nope. Bro, you you you, 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 have, you, have, you, have, you have trouble like, getting your dash here too, right? Well, recently, a couple of spots have opened to... Deliver here? Yes. Nice. A couple of pubs, and actually a, the Papa Gino's of Webster will deliver here now. Really? Yeah. Papa Gino's. So, it's really just like staying updated and saying, alright, is there any place now that will deliver? And the answer right. is yes. Yo, you know, the, you know the Papa Gino's at Route 1? Yes. It just doesn't deliver to Central Mall, yo. It's just, they don't, like, he doesn't deliver out of mass, I guess. I'm like, hmm. well, like people who live in Cumberland, like, which is like you know, probably like you know, like half a mile down the road, you can't order from that Papa Gino's. Yeah, that's uh, that's very unfortunate for them. And I'm like, come on, like you know, it's not even that far. Like I went to the mileage from like from my house to that Papa Gino's. I'm like, no one really lives there. Like, that's fucking <laughs> Yeah, it's not like we have that one in uh, Newport Ave anymore. What's happening to that plaza, bro? Dying. I, well, they opened up the new Taco Bell there to replace the old one they had. Yeah? Yeah. Well, Taco Bell was like, the plaza itself is dying, but Taco Bell is Taco Bell, bro. People yeah, yeah. Bell, bro. Yeah, no matter what. Uh, yeah, that definitely has, like, potential to be something cool in the future if anyone wants to do something there. That plaza? Yeah. Because it's just, like, land that's not being used for anything. Wait, wait, that theater, the, the Dollar Theater, that's still open? No, it's closed. Like, officially, or is it closed? I think, no, I think so. It, it closed uh, before COVID. Really? Yeah. That sucks. People used to go there and fuck all the time, yeah? I know. I can't do that anymore? Fuck, man. You know, I, 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 you know the hookup spot? You no, I didn't, that? I didn't. Know it really that. is. I remember in high school, people would be on, like, 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 let's say, like, I don't know, you're like calling a teenager. You don't have a spot. For sure, let's say that. I'm going to go out dating my girl. You know, you, know, you, know, you know they had a date there. They weren't going to watch me. No. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, I was like, I'm going to stop. Now it's gone. No. What, what, are the, what are the locals going to do? Yeah, the what, where, where are the locals? <sighs> yes. Where are these horny teenagers going to go? I don't know, dude. <laughs> <That's> stupid. <laughs> <laughs> 